Hi, I am Brianna Trust, and today I will be interviewing Marty Lyons. How are you? Good, good. Um, so how was it when you were like growing up, and did you ever think that you would be this big? You know what? When I was growing up, I had three older brothers and older sister, and to be honest with you, I probably couldn't beat up any of the four till I got into like. 10th grade so I was always the whipping stick of the kids and I had a younger brother and a younger sister and um, we were all very athletic and playing football in the backyard you know it was always you know three against four and uh, we always competed when I got to high school I had three old older brothers there all with the same last name so expectations were pretty high all right. um, going into the NFL what was your biggest fear well, I think the biggest fear was um, failing. Biggest fail uh, disappointment too would have been not having any longevity. You know, you work your whole life to get there, and I think it was a disappointment on my part to see that, you know, what here I am playing in the NFL. It wasn't what I thought it was going to be, because now you go from winning in college to losing in the NFL, and I think sometimes that the best collegiate players, they almost get punished going to the worst NFL teams because of the way the draft is set up. Okay. How do you think you impacted your team? Well, I think I impacted them by playing 100% every game. I always tell people that uh, when you hear a coach say, give me 110%, you really can't give anybody 110%. If I was your coach, I would say, give me 100% and then some. Because the then some will really distinguish you as an athlete. She stays after. She gets extra shots and she puts in extra time. But nobody can give me, nobody can give anybody 110, but give me 100% and then some. So during your career, if you had one thing you could change, what could it be? You know, that's a good question. I don't think that I would uh, want to change anything. You know, certainly I would have wanted to be a part of a Super Bowl team. But uh, at the age of 61, I like who I am. And success had a great deal uh, with making me who I am, but also failing at different things made me who I am. So uh, to go back and have any regrets or try to repeat things and try to make them different, I don't know if, uh, if winning the Super Bowl would have made me any different. So I'm pretty content with who I am now. That's all the time we have today. Thank you. Boost back to you.